Okay, we're going to do a little bit of a uh, quick uh, assessment of what we're up to. Um, like I talked about before, I have a level of machines and then a level of conveyor belts underneath. So if I choose seal ingot, we need 45 minutes of iron and 45 minutes of coal to make steel ingots. We've got 270 coming in, so divide that by 45 gives us 6. So I can per uh, 270 belt speed, I can have six um, foundries. And it just so happens that I have two lots of pure uh, coal nodes coming in, bringing uh, 270 belt uh, of coal. And I have some normals overclock to bring 270 of iron each. So we can have 12 foundries in this building currently with the resources we're bringing in. So I'm going to build um, 12 foundries on this floor. And the way I do it is that I have them facing each other. And we do, well, we just have them, uh, I have the foundries up above. And we'll show you how this works in a minute. So I have them floating off the edge here. Not floating, but this is an allowed although I might bring it back one. See, it's 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 either here or there. It, it can be floating a lot one way. Here we are. See, that's how it is right now. If I'll go back, it's poking over the back. So it's, it's kind of... You've got no choice in the matter. You can see, but this wasn't aligned in the center. But just use those lines there like that. There we go. Perfect. Okay. So then for me to do this again, I'm going to line this one up here. And I think it's there. You want to have a look. And you can always look. Looks here. So like this back foot is on the edge. This back foot's on the edge. It's really important to try and, when you're doing an organized build, Come up with something you can follow each time. It's going to make things very easy. Now, what we're going to do is... Splitters are great. Splitters have three outputs and one input. And we have three machines. So each side we're going to split the resources. Um, and then we're going to join, and then we're going to, so one belt coming in of 270 will split left and right, and then we'll split those three in three ways, and then we'll get that full even distribution out. This is the difference between, this is kind of like a, a this is a load balance setup with a bit of organization thrown in. Now what I do do here to make things easy, Hey, Smackin', you just gotta follow. Ooh, I'm a tomato. No, no, I am a tomo. Thank you for the follow. Now, what I'm gonna do here is, for simple ease of uh, organization, and for me uh, running conveyor lifts and all that, and splitters, I'm going to here just build some foundations here temporarily. And you'll see why in a second. So each one needs 45 in. So I'm going to go back to my Mark 1 and I'm just going to drop a conveyor lift. Actually, I'm going to drop it behind that way. So then I'm going to put a splitter right there facing outwards. And then what you'll do is at the same spot over here. And oops, this one here. Hey, Smackin, you just got to follow. Mr. Frost87, thank you for the follow. Going back to my conveyor one belts. That to there, that to there, and that one will be in here. 
And what you can see is it's extremely neat and organized. And we're just going to mirror, same here. And if I am correct, if I put that there like this, it lines up perfectly. And that one there. And you can see I'm going quite fast because it's so easy and so repetitious that you, you can do that. Um, and the next floor down is going to be here at this height. And I'm going to come back to that in one second. Um, we're probably actually going to go, to be honest, one more to there. But I want to come back to that because before we get rid of this building area, let's do the other side for the other machines. Let's get all this height done first. So we just follow this same formula over here. And from me looking just before, I'm positive that's that position there. And that is that position there. And you can hear the clicks. You know that everything's connecting correctly when that's the case. And so it's this one. 